What's up, YouTubers? Just getting ready to go out and bash. Um, looking over the cars, making sure everything's working. Everything looks good. Um, and I am noticing, you can see it on the video, but we do have a bend right here in the V4. So I'm, I'm going with the stock chassis right now. I have it upgraded to the M2C Racing. Um, if you can see it right, right there, you can see the bend uh, starting to happen right there. So even with the Voltage Hobby braces, everything else, this thing is still flexing enough. It's bending that tower to tower brace. So anyway. Got this thing put back together. Um, you know what I did notice that these RPM arms, you can kind of see it, they rub on the diff case. There's not a lot of clearance there. So I did take a Dremel and just removed just enough material so we actually had enough room for it to <laughs> Little slushy. Ooh. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> yeah, we got a pond back there, boys. Sand isn't quite as soft as it was the other day. Was a close save. Yeah. Landing them up today, boys. <laughs> yeah, that wasn't probably that good on the rear control arm. A little harder than I wanted. There's another nice double, I'll take it. Ho, 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 ho. It's a triple, boys. Quite land it, but take it. This is running good, boys. Gonna hit that, that net, boys. <laughs> yep, broke my wing now, boys. Whoa, that was close to that net, boys. Touchdown, boys. Not what I was looking for. Ooh, that was brutal.
been a rough RC week, boys. I'll show you a video. My smoked, my ES stock BLX ESE. Whoa, boys, I keep, man. I keep moving this ramp, thinking I'm gonna get further away from the net and it seems to be drawing me closer and closer to it. Ooh, nice double, but it didn't want to land for me. Like I said, this sand's probably even harder than the dirt is right now. God, this thing's all sandy. Wasn't quite done bashing and my battery cut out so on my GoPro and I didn't notice it. So sorry about that. Um, one of the bad landings for the uh, Outcast. I landed really hard on my rear uh, rear wing mount. Um, broke the modification that I made. And as you can see, it just demolished this hot racing rear shock tower. So um, good news is... The techno standoffs held. I am uh, completely amazed that it took that much abuse. And these aren't bent. That shock tower, though, is completely bent. Needless to say, everything's mounted in the V2 or V3. Went out and tested it last night. Got it all grassy. Um, and it looks like I cooked my ESC. So I actually at one point did see some smoke come out. Um, boy, this thing was crazy. It had crazy power though. Uh, it was wet grass and I just throttle up and it was just, it seemed like it had power for days. So um, needless to say, now I'm just getting the, the flashing red. No steering, no throttle. Um, Try to set the throttle. And then I get nothing. So I'm at a quandary. Uh, whether to go to maybe a Max 6 and a 4092 Hobby Star or Leopard motor. I think I'd have the same problems in the V4. Given all the weight I've added to this rig. Did put a hot racing uh, motor mount in here. Because I did find the last motor when it was going out. It actually twisted my uh my motor mount 